A devastating airplane crash killed 18 people after it was crashed and caught fire while it was taken off from Nepal's capital, that's Kathmandu. The pilot is currently receiving treatment in hospital. He is the only survivor of Wednesday's fatal accident and it was after he, it was being rescued from the burning wreckage. The Shuro Airlines flight was carrying 17 company employees. They included technical staff as well as two crew members. It was bound for the Himalayan tourism hub of Pokhara in the country's west. Nepal's aviation industry has a poor safety record that has been attributed to multiple factors over the years, from unpredictable weather to lax regulations. The flight was heading for Pokhara as part of a routine maintenance check. It crashed at about 11. 15 local time that is 5.30 GMT. It was a few minutes after it took off from Tibobon International Airport. Police spokesperson Dan Bahadur Karki told BBC Nepali that the pilot sustained injuries to his eyes and forehead, but said his life was not in danger. One man was inside a nearby shop when the accident occurred. He said there was a very loud noise. It sounded like maybe a truck had overturned on the road. We ran after we saw the crash, the plane then hit the ground and caught fire. We were about to run to the side but then there was an explosion so we ran away again, he told. A free news agency airport chief Jagannath Niralu told BBC Nepali that the accident happened as soon as it left the ground. It was in not even a minute. Though airport authorities have not been able to confirm the cause of the disaster. However, the head of Tibubon International Airport said an initial assessment showed that the plane had flown in the wrong direction. As soon as it took off, it turned right when it should have turned left. Mr. Nerola told BBC Nepali. Footage of the incident showed the plane tilting above the runway before it crashed into the ground into flames. It quickly became involved, enveloped in fire and smoke. Photos showed rescue workers. They were making their way through the wreckage with large parts of the plane that was completely blackened and charred. Photos of the aftermath also appeared to show parts of the plane inside an air freight container. Fire engines and ambulances were rushed to the spot after the incident occurred. 17 of those died there, Nepali, where while one was a Yemeni national who was working as an engineer. The plane was scheduled to undergo maintenance for a month beginning Thursday. It, was, it is unclear why it crashed. Shuro Airlines marketing head Mukesh Kanal Writers News Agency reports Kathmandu Airport closed temporarily after the crash but was reopened within hours, writers said. Nepali, Nepal has been criticized for its poor air safety record in January 2023, at least 72 people were killed. It was in a Yeti Airlines crash that was later attributed to its pilots. He mistakenly cut the power. It was the deadliest air crash in Nepal since 1992 uh, when all 167 people and on board a Pakistan International Airlines plane died when it crashed on approach to Kathmandu Airport. Shoro Airlines operates flights to five destinations within Nepal with a fleet of three Bombardier CRJ-200 jets according to the company's website. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.